Hello everyone. Welcome to Tech Shadow. Today we are going to start a new course which is Digital Logic Design Lab. In this course we will implement some uh, problems related to digital logic design and we will use this multi-sim software and after implementing those problems I will upload the simulation file and I will put the link in video description and you can download the simulation file and you can practice in your PC or laptop so let's start today's topic title is studying different digital integrated circuits and today we will implement a simple problem we will place a NAND gate here and we will check the conditions of NAND gate that NAND gate is working successfully or not so before starting uh, we have to know there are seven basic logic gates and or not not NAND X not XOR and every gates has its own pin config configuration like and it has it pin conf configuration 748C08 and you don't uh, need to know the this characters values 8C you just you have to know the uh, numerical values uh, you need to know this IC value because in multi sim we are going to search these gates using this pin configuration so let's start with NAND, NAND gate we know that only if when the both input is high then the NAND gate output will be low and otherwise the NAND gate output will be always high so let's see here the pin configuration of NAND gate is 7400N or 7400 so you have to search this NAND gate in multi-sim for searching this component just click here place TTL in the left hand side follow my mouse cursor place TTL click here and search 7400 here you can see 74001 and, and the symbol of NAND gate. Click OK. Select A, B, C, D. Anything. And now we will check if the output is high on light will be on. And if output is low light will be off for this we need a light so search probe ok so you can see probe we cannot find the probe because the group is selected TTL we have to select all groups then right probe ok we will not use this probe will use the probe digital red uh, you can use any on as you wish so place the probe here now for input a and b 0 and 1 or 0 0 we need some constant value right inter interactive digital constant place here we need 2 another one and close then connect this constant with the NAND gate and then connect the NAND gate with the probe light so we will check if the two input is low or 0 0 the light will be on only if when the two input is high or 
1 then the uh, output will be low that means the light will be off so uh, both input is low 0 0 let's run the project here you can see the light is 1 if we change this 0 1 light is 1 if we change this 1 0 light is 1 if we change this on on the light is off so simply this is very easy you can practice in home so that's all thank you